as we have completed all the models so now we need to assemble them in an order so go for creating a new assembly go ahead take the assembly design and KJA that is knuckle joint assembly save ok and now go for retrieve the component the first one that is fork end and say default the constraints as a for the first component so this gets assembled default uh, that is the coordinate system of this component with the coordinate system of the assembly will get assembled and now call the second component which is I end so take this int surface and this surface to insert with each other and select this top surface of the I end and the bottom surface of the fork end and just mate it with respect to each other so done just activate this completing this so now we here we have given only 25 as the depth so make it as 28 symmetrically and say regenerate so that component gets regenerated in the same assembly and just say control activate control A so to activate the assembly so 28 has been activated and now calling the third component which is pin so insert this pin with respect to this internal diameter of this fork end and take the bottom surface of the fork end with the top surface of this uh, pin to meet with respect to each other and say done this is our model and calling the next component which is color so insert the color with respect to this and select this bottom surface of the color with the top surface of this so it gets assembled and call the fifth component which is a tapper pin and say insert and select the cylindrical surface and say insert with respect to each other and select this center datum plane of the color and the center datum plane of this pin to align with respect to each other and just say coincident so that pin will get assembled at that particular location and say done so this way we can assemble all the parts of the knuckle joint this is our knuckle joint assembly